Yo, what's up, everyone? Rain is back again with some more Scarlet Nexus. I really, really, really love this game. I like I've been playing this in Monster Hunter Stories too, right? And I, they're both great, actually. I can't really like pick the two, but I but when it comes to the combat, I really love the combat in this one. But then Monster Hunter Stories 2 is like traditional like JRPG turn-based combat, which I really enjoy a lot. Um, so please smash that like button for me if you haven't already. And hush, guy. Anyway, smash the like button for me. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. We're going to get into this, so let's go. And also, I think... Yeah. I think there's something over there. No, duh. What is this, actually? An environment, huh? Can I go through there with teleportation or is this? Oh. This area should be safe enough to talk. Is it true that the new Himuka government was transforming people into others? Yes, it was a long time ago, but Fabuki's fiance, Alice Ichijo, was also metamorphosed. My brother and Fabuki began investigating the cause of Alice's metamorphosis. The case led them to find out about New Himuka's personality rehabilitation, metamorphosis technology, and the surveillance systems of each city. Excuse me, do you mean my Aunt Alice? That's right, she was your aunt. Have you heard anything? No. I was told she joined OSF and planned to leave when she turned 20, but she was killed in the line of duty. That's why my family was in such strong opposition to me being scouted. But since we're legally unable to refuse... Hey, I found the file on Alice Ichijo in the database. She looks exactly like Hanabi. Alice was the daughter of OSF Hospital's previous chairman. That's why she was engaged to Spring Pharmaceuticals Major General Fubuki. I think that's true. It's the first I've heard this, but it seems plausible. If this was a plan led by the new Himuka government, does that mean my father knew about it? Oh. I think he did. Moreover, it might be better to assume that he was at the center of it all. The Sumeragi family has a long history in politics, after all. Then does my brother know about it too? Am I the only one who was kept in the dark? Yuito, Kasane is coming. Eight o'clock. <laughs> Kasane? Just hold on! We can talk this over! No point. You'll be dead. Oh, come on. Why are you trying to kill me? At least tell me the reason. Stop, won't get away. I told you I don't want to talk. Hey! Get up. Huh? If you're trying to kill you, so we're all fi we're fighting all of them? Everything to stop you. Just wanted to stay out of this. Fine. Will you please calm down to me? Well, I'm gonna set her on fire. I won't make the same mistake twice. I'm going to stop Kasane. Oh, whatever she just did to me there, dude. That's the plan. Let's go. Where is she? Yes, 
That's not what I meant to do. Let's go. Oh, oh. Is she turning into a, oh, she can do that too? Some enemies that use powers can create a brain field with some exceptions. You can't use psychokinesis attacks while in the enemies in brain field. You will need to overcome it with weapon attacks or SAS. Green fields will disperse after they set time. You need to wait it out. Shit. Really? Oh, I died. I did not mean to. Okay. Well. Please get it together. Thanks. Sorry for the trouble. Revived by an ally for the first time. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Oh, 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 oh. You want me to do it too? I can do it. She wants to be like that. I could be mean and petty. Well, let's go. I can get her back. Ha. You don't like that, do you? You don't like that, do you? Beat her up. Witness my strength. Huh? I have to do it. Get her. Answer me, Kasame. No, I can't lose now. Got her. Let's go. Kasane, tell me, why did you kill my father and join Seiron? <sighs> Is it because my father was involved in metamorphosis research? Because new Himuka turned Naomi into an other? So you found out about it too. Yes, that's exactly right. Hey, Kodama's coming. What? What is she doing here? Master Yuito, Kodama is here. Huh? Wait, Kasane! Oh, that traitor Kasane is here too? That's fine. It is a pleasure to meet you, Master Yuito. I'm Kodama Malone. I believe this is our first time meeting as well. Oh, you're right! But I'm only loyal to Master Yuito. What? Oh, Master Yuito, I have a message from Master Fubuki. He's taking care of everything, so you can come back now. So, are you on our side, Kodama? Of course! I am always on your side, Master Yuito. Officially, my position may be the leader of Kodama Platoon and Major General Fubuki's aide, but my heart will always belong to you, Master Yuito. You could have just contacted us instead of coming all the way out here, Kodama. Maybe no one trusts you, Wataru. I mean, your sister went to Seiron after all. Shut up. Don't group me in with Haruka. And it wasn't just to deliver a message. I had to give this to you, too. What is it? Your medicine that was discarded at the OSF hospital. Oh. Is that okay? I don't mean to offend my uncle, but isn't it dangerous to take meds from the OSF hospital? Hanabi, and this goes for the rest of you as well, but it's in your best interests not to talk about or criticize the hospital in Suo. I'm sure you know why. Because the government is monitoring everyone. Exactly. Well, I'll be going 
going back now. See you later, Master Yuito. Oh, brother. Huh? This ampule. It's the same as the one I found in the abandoned underground subway. Why don't we stop by the hideout before returning to Suo? To go over everything we learned. We won't have to worry about anyone listening there. And don't worry. Recording conversation data through my control system isn't allowed. Now that I think about it, Major General Fubuki probably prohibited recording in order to protect the OSF after he learned the truth about the government. Yeah, maybe. That looks like the ampule that turned his friend into an other, right? So much has happened. It feels like my brain is fried. Let's go over our situation first. Research on powers is being conducted at the old Ichijo OSF hospital building. It's likely they progressed in the research of the brain, gained the ability to turn people into others, and perform personality rehabilitation. Yes. You can't blame yourself. You didn't know about any of this. Yes. You are so kind to everyone. So... I think you should be kind to yourself, too. Thank you. Moving on. The government is well aware that we've come to know this information. Major General Fubuki is trying to put out the fires. But it would be best to consider the possibility that we will become fugitives from the government. Anyone on the run from the government won't survive. Wait. There's Seiron. Yes. Worst case scenario. We should consider fleeing to Seiron. And Yuito, how has your memory been? I haven't had any missing gaps in my memory recently. I think. If anything strange happens, please let us know. Although, concerning that medication you were prescribed. It was prescribed by the OSF hospital. It kind of scares me. Yes, I'm concerned as well. Right. I think it would probably be best to avoid taking it, unless your condition significantly worsens. You're right. I'll do that. Hey, do you think it would be a good idea to ask my brother about this? Oh yeah, Chief Sumeragi is your older brother. I would advise against it. The Chief is with the government, after all. Of course, he is also your family. But any unnecessary contact would be dangerous right now. I wouldn't want to hinder Major General Fubuki in any way. Yes, you're right. Kaito, were you aware of New Himuka's power experiments? Did Dad and Kaito do that to Nagi? Damn it. The only one that was left in the dark was me. Only me. Yuito, wake up! Wataru is on the line. <sighs> Sorry. I only meant to take a little break, but it looks like I fell asleep. So, Wataru. What's up? Is the fact that we snuck into the old OSF hospital going to be an issue? No. Major General Fubuki was able to take care of that for us, so that's not a problem anymore. It might not be a big deal, but I thought I should let you know about the hole in Kunat Highway. Now that you mention it, there was something strange in the sky above Kunat Highway. I guess you could call it a hole. So much happened after that, I'd forgotten about it. So what was it? The government is calling it the Kunat Gate. A survey team took a look, but aside from the extremely localized gravitational anomaly, they don't know anything about it. It's just that it has similar characteristics to a black hole, so that area has been deemed off-limits. Kunat Gate. Nothing could be seen on the other side. It was unsettling. You might not go there, but I figured it's better to know about it than not. That's true. Thanks for telling me about it. If you learn anything more, please let me know. As you wish. Oh, I almost forgot. Yuito Platoon's next orders are to stay on standby. So you can hang around the hideout a little while longer. Really? Then I think we should do just that. Yes, that is a good idea. Knowing Fubuki, I'm sure he arranged all of this. So I think it's best to comply.
Mind if I come in? Major General Fubuki, how did you find this place? I told him. I thought it would be safer to talk here in the hideout rather than meet in the safe zone every time. Thank you, Luca. I managed to sneak past their surveillance, so we should be fine for a little while. They started monitoring you? I told you before that I was a government dog, but I don't have to be a dog anymore, now that Karin's gone. What do you mean? Karin's personality didn't make him popular with the government. The top brass has been targeting him for elimination or personality rehabilitation for some time now. That's why I took on the role of being the government's puppet, directing the OSF in Karin's place. So, does he... He doesn't know that I had to become his monitor in order to protect him from the government. Besides, even if I told him, he'd probably just tell me to stay out of it. To be honest, I'm a little relieved. I don't have to be the government's yes-man anymore. Government surveillance will be stretched thin after Ceyron's uprising. I don't plan on missing this opportunity. I should be able to bring change to this country by taking a different path from Karin. Different path? What are you planning on doing? This country is aggressively pursuing power research through illegal human experimentations. I have no idea why. They can get away with it because the government has complete control over information. Even the media is under the government's monitoring and influence. I want to find out why they would do this and free this country from its corrupt system. Karin joined forces with Ceyron and rebelled against the state to do the same. However, I feel that collapsing the government system from the inside is the fastest way to results. My brother is trying to change this country from the outside, while you're trying to change it from within. Yes. Feigning loyalty allows us opportunities to learn valuable information. We should be able to find out what the government is hiding through the city computer Arahobaki. Please, let me help you. I want to know what my father has done, and what my brother is hiding. Yuito, you are the commander of this platoon, and a commander's number one responsibility is to their platoon members. If you attempt to pursue these government secrets, it will undoubtedly put your platoon members in danger. Are you fully aware of that? Then please, remove me from command. I can't do that because, for better or worse, there are many eyes on you. There's also the fact that your post was specifically ordered by Chief Kaito Sumeragi. Well, if we all agree with what Commander Yuito is doing, then it doesn't matter. Yama! Either way, my time with the OSF is drawing to an end. I'm getting too old. But before I leave, I want to uncover the truth. I want to know why that happened to Naomi, and why Nagi received personality rehabilitation. I agree with Gemma. If you're going to try to uncover the government's secrets, then I would like to help. I was also subjected to this country's human experiments. What do you mean? My brother Karin and I received power enhancement treatments. I had no idea. If Yuito can't be removed from the platoon, then you can remove the platoon members instead. Any member who doesn't want to take part in this can simply be assigned to a different platoon. Fine. I can't very well turn down your help now. However, reorganizing your platoon requires paperwork. So I will issue you an official deployment order in the meantime. Please gather intel around the Seiron area. I've heard OSF deserters are appearing around Mizuhagawa. Former OSF members sympathetic to Seiron's cause could be up to something. While you're investigating, I will take the steps necessary to reassign Hanabi and Sugumi to a different platoon. What? Oh. Okay, get to it then. Yuito, I'll stay in the platoon as the operator. I feel the same as you and Gemma. I'll help you stop the government from doing whatever they want. Thanks, Wataru. Well, that sucks. Okay. New area this time. I'm ready to go at any time. I, I think. Need to get out there. Wait, no, I've been here before. Yeah, I have been here before. Uh. 
Yeah, it's a little fighting area. The resource reading is close. Should we get it? There's a chance that Sauron OSF patrols might show up beyond this point. Let's keep our eyes open. Were you serious about what you said back at the hideout? About helping Major General Fubuki? Right. Because wouldn't that mean going against your brother and your late father? I'm... staying in this platoon. What? Sugumi. What happened to Naomi was terrible. And if the government had something to do with it, then I won't let them get away with it. Hold on. Incoming others from the front. Hanabi, Tsugumi, we'll talk later. For now, let's clean up the other. Yeah, you're right. Understood. Are there any more others? I'm not reading any. Mm. Yuito, are you okay? No, it happened again, didn't it? Huh? Yeah, I didn't take too much damage in that fight. What are you talking about? You suddenly said your head hurt and stopped dead in your tracks. Huh? Did you black out again? Do you remember what we were talking about? Hanabi asked me if I was really going to help Major General Fubuki, and then Sugumi said she was going to stay in the platoon. And after that? After that, we got attacked by others, so we obviously didn't talk about anything. <laughs> right? You don't remember Luca and Gemma's stories? What did they talk about? About my aging, and the experiments Luca was subjected to. <sighs> Sorry, I don't remember any of that. Did you really talk about that? Yuito, I was listening, so I can verify. I'm not seeing any abnormalities to your status, so maybe it's just mental exhaustion, like the doctor said. The more you use your power, the more you tax your brain. It might be better to avoid fights right now. I can't do that. We have our assignment. Are you really okay? Snake boat. Ginger. Huh? What? Flax pig. Table slug? What? None of the words are matching what I'm thinking. Apple home child. I see an abnormality in his cranium. What's going on? His speech is impaired. His brain must have experienced a great amount of stress. Well, what can we do? We have the medication the hospital provided. But that ampule seems fishy. It looks exactly like the ampules we found at the abandoned subway. Everyone, be careful. You have an other closing in on you. His timing couldn't be worse. 
Stay here and rescue Ito. We'll handle the others. Damn it! My head feels like it's going to split in two! I cannot. This isn't good. I can't use my power at all. I won't even be able to fight. What can we do? Is there some way to cure him? Do I drink it? Yuito. <laughs> Time to be squeamish. That other's gonna kill me if I don't take this. I have to. <laughs> Yuito? Did he drink the medication? Sugumi! I'm looking now. Oh, the abnormality in his cranium is starting to disappear. This medication is really working. Uh, my head is starting to hurt a lot less. Yuito, I can understand what you're saying now. Can you fight? Yeah, I'm good to go. Let's take them out. That's really crazy. I can move. It doesn't hurt as much. I can do this. Damage to outer shell confirmed. Keep going and break it. At this rate. on my end how are you feeling yuito i feel fine now i know i had you worried but i'm glad i took it honestly i wasn't going to be any help in that condition that makes sense and i'm not seeing any signs of side effects either perhaps there was no need to worry about the medication after all well it smelled weird and tasted really bad are we going to continue on our assignment Shouldn't we go back to the hideout and rest a little bit? I'm fine. My powers are working normally again. I'll let you know if something feels off. Let's keep going. Copy that. But please don't push yourself too hard. Promise me. Okay. I promise. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> okay, I must have made it all the way down here. That's, I wonder if it's the, not the brain thing, the, um, well, yeah, the brain space or whatever. Um, like he's having issues, but he uses it maybe. Maybe it's, no idea. Or maybe. Looks like there's a resource nearby. Well, there's also enemies. And... Watch out for electric. You won't be able to move if you're electrified. Regroup now. I hate these things. Let's 
Regroup. Do you need help? Jesus Christ. Not yet. Oh my gosh. I hate these things already. Here we go. Now die. Yes, die. Where's he at? Oh. Uh. Oh, I dodged that. Jesus, those are horribly annoying. F the game for putting that in there. Good God. I was going the wrong way anyway. No, I just wanted to just get healed again. Did that not work? Okay. I'm going to get stronger. Okay, bro.
expect so many. Hear me both. Oh yeah, let's go. Sorry I was so quiet guys. I was uh I know I was really focused on that for for some reason. Um where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to go wait that way or am I supposed to go that way? They want me to okay. They do want me to go this way. Just checking. Oh, come on, dude. Oh, hello, dude. Thank you. Okay. Okay, where are we heading to? Wait, there's something up ahead. The extinction belt is thick above that area, so I can't detect anything from my end. Any other information? I think... They're trucks. Two of them. They're moving towards Ceyron? Hmm? What is it? Um, I thought I just saw something inside the truck bed. Although, it was probably my imagination. Okay, I managed to tap into a nearby surveillance camera feed. Those are OSF transport vehicles. Enemy or ally? Yuito Platoon is the only OSF team deployed near Mizuagawa. Then I guess that means they're Seiron's OSF team. <gasps> I see two individuals heading towards us. It looks like Kagura and Kyoka. Of course, they're invisible. Be careful, I'm not picking them up at all. Clairvoyance. All right, right. here they come. Right. Invisible. Wow. Take that. Too late. But what were we just on a date? I wonder why Kyoka and Kagura attacked us. I thought that Kasane was the one after Yuito. Is it because they're on Kasane's side? For some other reason? Regardless, please be careful. Regroup. Even if you're going this far. My can see you. Your power is the absolute worst to go against. I wonder if that's why we're such good friends. If you really think that, then retreat. We don't want to do this. What's so easy? Now my old trusted commander is my enemy. Yes, you are a good soldier. I didn't want it to end up like this. Let's regroup. Yeah, it's too bad. I'm using this, Sugumi. I'm using this, Sugumi.
forget. They're stronger than anticipated. Let's go. We did what we needed to. Were Kyoka and Kagero guarding this area? Could it have to do with the transport vehicle? They were clearly stalling for time. I'll try to follow them. Sugumi, could you send me their tracking data? I can't. There are so many Kagero's and Kyoka's. They're all going in different directions. That's Kyoka's duplication power. They're attempting to confuse us. I'm sorry. It's going to take time to identify the real pair. I also lost sight of the transport vehicles. I hate losing. It was a diversion to hide the transport vehicle's destination from Sugumi. Which direction were the vehicles going the last time you saw them? I think towards Seiron. They must have been carrying something important if they made sure we didn't follow. We might be able to find out some key information. Give me some time. I'll see what I can find out with Tsugumi's information. What's really crazy is... Yuito, there's a place I want to check out, but it's in a different direction from Seiron. It looks like the duplicates are all avoiding this area. I can't be sure, but it seems suspicious. Nice catch, Wataru. Okay, we'll go check it out. Oh. Supernatural Life Research Facility, huh? What is this place? There's nobody here. Hey! I see the transport vehicles. Then this must be it. We're pretty far from the city. Do you think this is still Seiron's facility? I can't seem to find any information on it at all, which only makes it more suspicious. Looks like they haven't noticed us yet. But I do feel a strange presence here. I can't really put it into words either. I will go check the vehicle. Sugumi, Wataru, please cover me. Hey, Yuito. Are you remembering things okay? What about your speech? Any headaches? I'm okay for now. No need to worry so much. You weren't making sense. It's natural for her to feel worried. Don't push yourself too hard. You've always had health problems, ever since you were little. That's right. You did mention that before. Yeah. I spent most of my early childhood inside a hospital. They finally let me leave when I was around five, and I've been fine ever since. Wait, Luca found something quite alarming. What do you mean? I know what the transport vehicles are carrying. Human heads! That can't be! The transport vehicle was filled with these. No, I thought I was just seeing things, but they're really... One of the trucks was already empty, but I believe it was carrying the same thing. Two trucks worth of human heads? What in the hell for? Let's try sneaking in a little further. Kasane and her team might be here. Okay. We need to find out why they're doing this anyway. Ew. Human heads? Um, what I what I was saying, what I find crazy though is throughout this whole time we're fighting each other. Like you know, the other students or whatever. We'll go to the hideout and then they're like, Hey, you wanna go on a date with me for a little bit and bond? Like I don't know, it's I just it's just, it's just kinda weird. Cause I literally just went out on a bonding episode with the two that I just fought, and now it's all like, hey, you know, be my, go on, a, go on a date with me or something. I don't know, it's weird. Anyway, we'll get through this. It won't open. I guess sneaking in is going to be harder than I thought. I can't use my clairvoyance on any of these doors. Who are... Uh-oh. I really wish I had the teleport ability though. 
Forgive the rough treatment. Don't worry, we only knocked him out. He won't be waking up for a while. Wow, all three of you were amazing. Thanks, I couldn't even move. I'm glad I have people like you who can make such quick decisions. Hold on, this might be a key card for the door. Nice find, Sugumi. We shouldn't have a problem getting in now. This puts us in enemy territory. I need to be ready for anything. Okay, let's try this door. Okay, key card number one. All right, what's okay? Uh, what's down this way then? Nothing. I mean, all this. Sh you don't have the key card number four. Oh. Uh, Yep. I could teleport in there, can I? It's not. Thanks. I'll take it. What's going on? Why are there others all over the place? This doesn't look like an abandoned building. It appears to be some sort of active research facility. Let's keep going. Please take it down, Yurika. What is that? You should be able to break the outer shell and keep attacking. Time to use this. If your body begins to burn with fire, now drain your health. So be careful. Oh, get off me. Successfully reached shell. Attack now. That attack works. That must be a weak spot. Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. We've become indispensable to each other. Yes, we have. Hmm. The resource rating is close. Should we get it? Well, the fact that they were transporting human heads is just like. I don't know. I, I wasn't expecting that. I was thinking they were the vials of the uh, whatever it was that transform um, transformed his friend into an other. So, like, I was thinking it was just going to be a whole vial of that stuff. Yet alone, <laughs> yet alone, human heads. Um, oh, that's right. I can't go through these, right? Level 29. Let's go. All right, wait, where am I supposed to go? Because it's telling me, I don't know. I think I'm going the wrong way. Am I not? Looks like I'm going the wrong way. I don't know. Oh, okay. Lock number two. What the hell is that? Do you need help? We will be able to move forward if we use my power, Yuito. We should use Hanabi's power. Next. Next. That was so easy. I need you 
What was this? Oh. Why is there a key card on the floor? There's a smudge that looks like blood on it. That's definitely blood. Perhaps a researcher was attacked by another. I would say so. Oh, save guy. Hello. I don't want to go in there. I mean, I do. Should I go down here or no? Like, I'm, I'm just intrigued because I know. What the f What? Am I... I don't know what... I don't know what just happened here, but... Key card number three... needs a key card to open, I think. Why is there two... Okay, let's just go and figure out what's up. This gate needs a key card to open, I think. Oh, okay. Weird. Wait, what not just here at the fuck? Yeah, that was yeah. Okay, I am hell. This gate needs a key card to open, I think. I'm a bit lost. Just in true RPG dungeon fashion, I am lost. Okay, so that one didn't, that took four. What does this one take? Number three. This gate needs a key card to open, I think. I am so confused. Okay. Okay, did I go this way? I did, did I? Okay, so... <laughs> right, there was a key card in here. I am so confused right now, but okay. I think I'll just go back downstairs and go. Uh... Yeah, number four, right? This gate needs a key card to open, I think. Okay. Well, it's weird because, like, uh, whatever. I 
love it. I love it. I love it. Those are so cool when they do that. Oh, Jesus. I actually didn't mean to do that. I was just going to say that that was a hell of a lot. That was like way too much. Like, Jesus. This looks like a... Uh... Let's go. All right, there's some other stuff I haven't explored though. I want to check the other areas because I know. Looks like there's a resource nearby. And oh duh. There's okay. no data on this facility, but a long time ago there was a plan to develop an academic city nearby. Interesting. Looks like an art museum was already built, so maybe they're using that. I'm using this, Sugumi. <laughs> Did I visit every place though? I don't think I did, did I?
Maybe. Hell, I don't know. You know what? I don't even care. I'm just trying to hurry up and get through this. Because <laughs> I'm confused as hell. All the while, my cat is jumping on around on my feet. All right, let's go. Number four, number four. There we go. Okay, it doesn't look like I can go through that gate, though. Alright. I imagine boss or like mini boss. Oh, there's another key. Hmm. You should be able to break the outer shell if you keep attacking. No, There we go. That was pretty cool. I know, right? Here we go. Time to use this. I hear the outer shell. I think I can break it if I focus my attacks. Where are you? I need your help. We should use Hanabi's power. That was easy. That was fantastic. That was like one of the most <laughs> coolest fights. I well, not coolest fights, but I just I just love the combat in this game. Okie dokie. So we got. Come on. I did not mean to do that. Here we go. 
Whoops. <laughs> my bad, my bad, my bad. All right, let's go save. Because we know what's about to happen. It's about to be a boss fight. Level zero experimentation division. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Gotcha. Oh, there we go. Interesting. What is this facility? It looks like some sort of assembly line. Hey, those boxes. Aren't they the same ones from that transport truck we saw? <laughs> what is it, Sugumi? Does it contain what I brought earlier? A human head. You've got to be kidding me. All of these? What in the world is this place? Others are being held in this building. And others feed on human brains. Even if that's the case, why does it seem like this factory processes the brains? I hate to say it, but couldn't they just toss in the whole head if they're just feeding them to the others? This smell... Where is it coming from? It does smell a little strange here. Almost like... blood. Those ampules! I think... Oh, I shit. Think this can't be real, right? Those were made by Spring Pharmaceuticals. Is he... Wait a minute. Is he an other? <sighs> that was pretty cool. Wait, is he an other? Like... Looks like Kyoka couldn't lose you. What is this? I think you've already figured it out. This is Spring Pharmaceuticals Seiron Factory. To be more accurate, it's an other research facility they run jointly with the Seiron government. They're using these heads to make their products. <sighs> Shiden, stay calm. Just concentrate on stopping Yuito. Wait, let's talk! Hey! First you won't tell me why you're trying to kill me. Now you're trying to hide this cool place? Don't you feel anything seeing what's going on here? What are you all thinking? This motherfucker here! I thought you were amazing since you were a cadet, Katani. But now you're trying to kill Yuito and trying to hide this facility? What happened to you? This isn't like you. I can still fight. Shut up. You don't know anything about anything. Then tell us. We don't know anything because you won't tell us anything. My body is numb. He just, they whooped my ass. Yeah, they whooped my ass. Let's let's redo that. Let's redo that. <laughs> I she I oh man, that dude with that lightning, he's a little fast. I like him. But holy crap. Don't blame me. I was so close to killing that other I was so close to killing her. Alright, fuck it. Let's go. I'll use this. I'll cheese it. Fuck it. <laughs> No time for this. I'm feeling really good. At this rate. Well, what? what the fuck? Don't blame me. Bro, like I can't. <laughs> I'm out of it already. Yes. Making drugs out of human heads Finally. is crazy. We have to stop them. But Naomi, she needs this. What do you mean? 
What is this facility for? That's... Uh... <sighs> I can't take this anymore. I'm telling them everything. No, I will. This place is an other research facility run jointly with Spring Pharmaceuticals, just like Arashi said. Human brains of people with powers are being brought here. A portion of them are transplanted into others to turn them into other weapons. The rest are turned into a medical solution to feed the others. That's horrible. Hey, are you really sure about Seiron? I know New Himuka has a lot of its own issues. It's not right that the government monitors everyone and controls all the information. But Seiron causing the uprising, that's just as messed up. Can we really let them get away with transplanting human brains into others or processing the brains into drugs? No, we can't, obviously. That being said, there are in fact some people who've been forced to accept it. Like my brother. And then there's Kasane. People whose loved ones have been turned into others. They depend on that medication. Human-born others can temporarily regain their senses when they take that medication. Even letting them talk. Holy shit. Does Karin have a family member that's been metamorphosed? No, not a family member. Has Luca or Fubuki mentioned it? Alice? <laughs> Yuito! His brain is... Yuito! Yuito? Is this happening because I used my power? My head is killing me! Are you okay? What's wrong? You look like you're in pain. There's something wrong with Yuito's brain. He's beginning to show signs of speech and memory impairment whenever he uses his power. I'm okay now. The pain is fading. Sorry to interrupt, but you need to leave now so we can call this a draw. Hurry up, or the others will come. We should leave too. That okay with you, Kasane? Yes. Yuito, our assignment is complete. We should withdraw. Yeah. We should get out of here as soon as possible. I really am just thinking... But he's an other. Wataru said he would report to Major General Fubuki for you. Okay. Uh, sorry. I know I should be the one to do it, but I'm just not feeling well. What are you talking about? It's okay. Don't worry about it. We all know how you feel. No, that's not exactly true. I can't understand how much pain you're in. I probably would have taken the ampule too if I were in your shoes. I know saying that won't help with whatever guilt or disgust you might be feeling. Thanks. I'm okay. The medication should be chemically processed, so consider them more like protein or amino acid supplements. It may be unpleasant, but looking at them this way might help you come to terms with it. Yeah, I know what you're saying, but it's just hard for me to do it. I know it might be difficult, but whatever you do, don't throw them up. What? You knew? We... well... We saw it happen. You were outside the hideout. Oh, we're sorry. Oh, right. I'm sorry. I know it's not in my stomach anymore. But I just couldn't... It's fine, but you have to fight through it. You can't make it a habit. You're right. Besides, Naomi... It must be so much harder for her. Being turned into another is awful enough, but now she has to... feed on these brains? I don't know where she is right now, or how she's doing. When I think about her, I know how much better off I am. If Naomi hasn't given up, then I can't either. I know I can get through it. After you do get through it, you'll be able to help support Naomi when you see her again. 
Yes. You're right. I... I need to get it together. I'm just wondering if New Himuka is stocking up on those ampules, knowing full well what they're made of. If that's the case, and they do indeed know, then they're going to have to answer to me. No. I have a feeling that New Himuka already knows everything. I just can't get myself to accept it. I'm sorry. Huh? You don't need to apologize. You have nothing to do with the hospital. I know, but I just wanted to apologize. I want to look into the hospital and do something about it. This is a tough position for the both of you. You too, Luca. Everything Karin has done must be hard for you. Sugumi had to see a lot of things she never wanted to as well. I think we've all had our fair share of suffering. But what's important is that we continue to support one another, right? Yeah. Sorry I worried everyone, and thank you. Didn't I have something to talk to Gemma about? Okay. I don't know what to tell you, Yuito. Just try not to do everything on your own. Okay, anyway. There's too much to handle. Let me help you pick save. up the slack. That's what a team is for. Thanks, Wa. All right, anyway. Wow, that's a really, like... I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'm just reading... I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but it just seems like... Well, if they're feeding the other's brains or, like, that medicine... Because, like, something's wrong with him and he's taking that medicine. Am I like it? So, I don't know. I could be wrong. I usually am. Anyway. Um, yeah, man. We're going to end it right here. I appreciate you guys for uh, kicking it here with me, doing some RPG and chill. I appreciate every moment so hit the like subscribe all that good stuff um i will see you guys in the next one as usual and i'm out of here everybody peace